and traders affected by the Guarimba Tipa market fire incident have called on government to come to their aid as they have lost their livelihood. Plus, TV Africa team visited the scene where victims were seen trying to salvage what was uh, left from the fire. Our correspondent, Amadin Uyi, reports. This is what remains of the once busy Guarimba Tipa garage market raised by an inferno in the early hours of Thursday, February the 4th. The market, which is located at the heart of the Guarimpa suburbs in the Federal Capital Territory, is said to have gone up in flames at around 1.25 a.m. on Thursday morning. Its cause is still unknown. We met the fire around 1 a.m. in the morning and we couldn't put it out until around 5.30 a.m. in the morning. We lost over 500 shops and goods worth about 1.5 billion naira. We tried to put out the fire but could not. The fire service came as well but couldn't do much. Anybody who says they know the actual cause of the fire is lying. Everyone woke up and met the fire. Even we, who were keeping watch as at the time it happened, do not know the cause of the fire. Everyone is attributing various things as the cause of the fire. Some say it was caused by an electric surge. Some say it was the carelessness of someone who was cooking. And some even say it was caused by a lit cigarette that was carelessly disposed. But no one knows the actual cause of the fire. Awalu Muhammadu is one of the many traders who has lost his business in the fire. He couldn't salvage anything from the shop. I have five shops, and in total, they are worth over 5 million naira. We are about 30 persons who raised money together for the five shops and couldn't even take out a single thing from any of the shops. We lost everything. I have two shops there. At the selling high blood medicine and handset. All of them are not taking... One single thing, I'm not taking it. Out of the over 1,000 persons who own shops in this market, over 900 of them couldn't salvage anything from their shops. Everything got burnt. I was in the house, my children called me, I should run and come that the, that the whole market is burnt. So we run, before we could come here, the whole thing has burnt. Others like Aminu Bala, now helpless says he has left everything to God. Nobody can pay, help me anything, not only God. Because all things why I lost insight, not only God pay, cover everything for me. Now God give me, God is collecting it. I know say, inshallah, God you will bring it back for me. Nigerians should please pray for us, as we have suffered a huge loss, and it is only God who can console us. Some of the traders spoke to PLUS TV Africa, calling on government to come to their aid. The government should please come to our aid because we are in a terrible condition. We have no business. We are many and many of us are the breadwinners in our families. We need the government now more than ever to help us out of our current predicament. Now go the government should run to help us because the thing, I think some will bear it, some might not bear it. The FCT administration has not made any official statement on the fire. Those present on ground say only one person lost his life in the incidents. Amadin Uyi, Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.